Have you ever wanted to test your trading strategies without any risk? Well, let me introduce you to paper trading, a feature that allows you to simulate trades in a completely risk-free environment using live market data. Imagine being able to experiment with stocks, Forex, and even cryptocurrencies without the fear of financial loss. This is an essential tool for both the budding trader keen to learn the ropes and the experienced trader looking to test new strategies or improve existing ones. It's like a sandbox for your financial acumen, a safe space to grow and refine your trading skills. And the best part? This feature is readily available on a user-friendly online trading platform known as TradingView. So, if you're ready to take your trading game to the next level without risking a dime, let's dive into the step-by-step -step process of how to use the paper trading feature on TradingView. TradingView is an online platform that offers a wide array of features for traders. It's a vibrant hub of market information, catering to the needs of traders around the globe. What sets TradingView apart is its extraordinarily user-friendly interface. Even if you're new to the world of trading, you'll find it easy to navigate and understand. TradingView doesn't limit itself to a single market. Instead, it opens up a world of possibilities by supporting multiple markets. Whether you're interested in stocks, forex, or cryptocurrencies, TradingView has got you covered. This versatility allows traders to explore various markets and diversify their portfolios. But that's not all. TradingView is widely acclaimed for its advanced charting features and a multitude of indicators that help traders make informed decisions. It's like having a personal assistant who's always ready to provide you with data-driven insights. Now that we've got a grasp of what TradingView is, it's time to delve into its paper trading feature. Getting started with paper trading on TradingView is a straightforward process. Let's break it down into a few easy steps. First things first, you need to have a TradingView account. If you don't have one yet, head over to their website and sign up. It's free and only takes a few minutes. Once you have your account, log in and navigate to the chart section. Now, here's where the magic happens. On the bottom side panel of your chart screen, you'll see a tab labeled as trading panel. Click on it and you'll find an option for paper trading. Click on connect to link your account to the paper trading feature. Just like that, you're all set to start paper trading. But how do you place orders? Well, TradingView offers a couple of methods. The first one is the buy and sell panel. Here, you can input the quantity and price of the stock, forex, or cryptocurrency you wish to trade. Once you're satisfied with your input, simply click buy or sell to execute the trade. Alternatively, you can use the order panel. This panel allows you to place more advanced orders, such as limit orders, stop orders, and stop limit orders. To use the order panel, select the type of order you want to place, fill in the required fields, and hit place. Remember, this is all simulated. You aren't risking any real money. It's a safe space to practice, experiment, and refine your strategies before diving into real-world trading. With your account all set, we're ready to make our first paper trade. Now comes the exciting part, making your first paper trade. In the world of paper trading, the first step is to choose your market. This could be stocks, forex, or cryptocurrencies. Each market has its own unique characteristics and dynamics, so you'll want to select one that aligns with your interest and trading goals. For beginners, stocks can often be a good starting point due to their relative stability and straightforwardness. Next, you'll need to decide on the specific asset you want to trade within your chosen market. This could be a particular company stock, a specific currency pair, or a certain type of cryptocurrency. When selecting an asset, Consider factors such as its volatility, liquidity, and the amount of information available about it. Now that you've executed a few paper trades, it's time to dive into the analysis. This process is invaluable as it allows you to understand the effectiveness of your strategies and improve them. Start by reviewing your completed trades. Look at each trade individually and scrutinize the decisions you made. Why did you enter the trade? What prompted you to exit? was the outcome as expected. These questions will help you dissect your thought process at each stage of the trade. Next, assess your performance. TradingView provides a wealth of metrics to do this. Pay attention to your win ratio, which is the percentage of trades that were profitable. Also, consider your risk-reward ratio, 
which is the potential profit of a trade compared to the potential loss. A higher ratio indicates a strategy that is less risky, but potentially more rewarding. Now let's move on to refining your strategies. Based on your analysis, you may notice patterns or trends. Perhaps you're better at trading certain types of stocks, or maybe your trades are more successful at specific times of the day. These insights can help you tweak your strategies for better results. Remember, paper trading is a learning process. Don't be discouraged by losses or mistakes. Instead, see them as opportunities for growth. Analyzing your trades will reveal your strengths and weaknesses, enabling you to focus on areas that need improvement. Finally, don't forget the importance of consistency. It's not about making one profitable trade, but about developing a strategy that brings success over time. So keep analyzing, keep learning, and keep refining your strategies. By analyzing your trades, you can identify what works and what doesn't, helping you become a more skilled trader. With TradingView's paper trading feature, you can test your various strategies and hone your trading skills without any risk. If you found this guide helpful, like, subscribe, and hit bell icon for more trading tips and tutorials. We will see you in the next video. Happy trading!